Ocala's Information Station, 1370 WOCA. Ocala! They say the show must go on. That's right. I don't know if they have any authority over us, though, whoever they are. <laughs> Good morning, Larry. Good morning, Robin. It's morning, time to have Joe. fun with the not quite well yet Joe Martone. Uh-huh. How you doing? Uh-huh. And you're the MC over at the Ocala's Got Talent. I heard that. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Oh, that's, but that's wonderful. A, that's a bit away, so you'll be yeah. okay by then, right? Oh, yeah. We're looking forward to that one. It's going to be fun. So we missed you the last couple of days. I miss you guys, too. Did you? Did, were you I would have rather been here. <laughs> were you listening in? I couldn't. No, no. It was, you were so sick, you couldn't even listen couldn't, to your no. own radio I, station. Yeah, I know. I was out of the zone. Just, just might have got you sicker, huh? No. <laughs> well, it depends who was on, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what did you have on, Larry? Are you hmm. trying to tell me something? <laughs> Tom and, uh, and Buddy had a, a flasher yesterday. I heard and I seen we have proof. <laughs> <laughs> we have proof there was a flasher. So now I feel jealous. I See, think there's we cameras should. out there and people don't realize that. Now they do. <laughs> well, where's our flash? We need one. Re- let me know because I'm not facing that way. You and Robin are facing that way. I'll tell you okay. as soon as soon as she puts her shirt back. So, you know when Robin was in New York. <laughs> when Robin was in New York, yeah. Dan was helping me out in the morning, and yeah. there was a guy who pulled down his pants in front of oh, the window. Good, gross. <laughs> yeah, and you didn't get a picture of that. Thank you. That would have been good. Thank. You. I don't think the cameras were up yet. Oh, okay. Right. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> no, they were. They were. Up. They were not. They were not. Uh. I thought he said they were. I don't know. Yes, they were. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't see it because I was looking the direction I'm looking right now. Okay. Yeah. So we have to have them come out this way. Knock on the window and say, we'll hey. We'll go solicit somebody. <laughs> hey, Larry, what? I got something <clears throat> to show you. Let's see. There was a, there was a day that for that. Remember? What? That's oh, there the was. Moon, yeah. The moon, the moon and Uranus. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did I say that right? I think you did, yeah. Good. Very right. Okay. Good, thank you. So you're feeling okay, though? You're feeling well enough to nah, do the show? Well, Not I'm really. Try. Yeah, it's, it's, if I zoom out of here, I'll come back. But So those betting on... I'll, 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 I'll so those betting you today, you might... You might uh, so do you know what we're doing today? I have no earthly idea. All right. Every state has something unique about it. That's true. So I'm going to tell you the unique thing, and you tell me what the state is. Simple as that. Okay. So Boston. It's, so it's multiple. Oh, Massachusetts. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so it's multiple choice, simply because there's only 50 states. Hey, he's pretty smart. But we I already so. covered 20 of them yesterday. So there's really only 30 choices today. I bless your heart. Now, would you like me to read the 20 that we read yesterday? Uh, Just so you know? No. No, okay. Okay. So in your mind, there's 50 choices. Yeah. And Robin's mind is 30 if she can remember all 20 states. Yeah, if I can remember them all. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I don't see any notes over here, so we're doing good. Yeah, I, I doubt that she remembers. What do we have to give away today? Oh, we've got two $5 coupons to Doughboy's Mini Donuts right here in the Paddock Mall. It's they did between a, a, here and Penny's. So that's a $10 prize on my end of the world. And you have a prize on your end of the world. Oh, I have a prize on my end of the world. Yes, you do. Well, win this prize, it says. <laughs> that's what it says I believe you oh, on the front of it says from helper win this prize that's perfect for a busy family it's a handy car trunk organizer great for when you head for the store to pick up chicken helper <laughs> that's a car organizer a car trunk organizer that wouldn't do anything in my trunk it looks like a, a mini filing cabinet yeah Whatever. It's oh, an accor- it oh, it opens. I thought I was breaking. It, it accordion. Oh, okay. it, it accordions out. It bellows out. <laughs> oh, so you can put your groceries in there and they won't fall all over the place. Especially. That's have you cool. thought about dinner tonight? Make they a delicious the- dish by starting with Helper and adding some of your favorite fresh vegetables and ingredients like sweet and sour chicken Helper. Has a mouth-watering sweet and sour glaze. Plus... It comes with white rice to complete the dish. Mm-mm. Do we have a gift card today, too? No. You're gonna, you just want me to look through that thing again. <laughs> Thank you, Robin, for saving me. I thought we had one yesterday we forgot about. It, I yeah, don't I, I, I don't know where it went. If I have it, I... <laughs> 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 I'm, 
<laughs> Gremlins from the damn gift card again. All right. I don't know. I don't know. Don't look at me. I wasn't here yesterday. Robin's going to go see the Black Pet and Leather Shoe play tonight with her mom. Yep. Oh, yep, our show. season tickets. Did you go I see it? I actually laughed out loud. Oh, oh that's you right. You went. Then. You went with uh, Chelsea, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. And, and Patsy, Patsy, and you guys liked it? Fine. Well, yeah. You and Patsy went with Chelsea. Chelsea told us. I actually laughed out loud. And how did she tell us? She said, please heard me. You went yeah. to see the nun on skates, is what how Chelsea told yeah. us. Yeah, yeah, the roller skates. The uh, well, like roller I said, skates. If I laugh, I'll laugh, haha. But if it's really funny, I mean, I out laugh anybody in the place and everybody just. Oh, really? And you know how you get a contagious laugh and somebody laughs because yes. you laugh? Mm-hmm. That's what happens. So if you're in the studio oh, audience of a, of, a, of a sitcom being videotaped, oh, you'd hear me. You'll be in the uh, soundtrack, whatever they call it. I was at Disney and I was in the soundtrack when I left. Were you? Oh, I, <laughs> oh, nice. If you, if you get me on a roll, I mean, something's really, really funny. Huh. And I start laughing, I just roll. I'm so glad you're doing well. We were worried about you. What? Yeah, very much Why? so. Why? What? We were worried about oh, you. Thank you. I That's the why. It. Oh, okay. We're still worried about the you. The why is because we love you. I think you need to go home and lay down. I am. <laughs> I am going to go home and lay down. You don't look good at all. No. Thank you. No. I hope Patsy drives no, you home. No, actually, and, in a photograph, you, you look drive. fine. It's just you're behaving like you don't feel well. I feel great. <laughs> I can't even do the great. I feel great. You know, my belly hurts too much. I can't, I can't get that. So Robin had food, food poisoning not too long ago. Oh, gee. Remember? Yeah, that was about a couple I mean, months ago. She went ago, to the yeah. hospital. Did you go to the hospital no, for yours? Oh, I didn't go to the hospital. I just had Gatorade. Wow. And a bananas. But you don't know what you ate. Have no idea. It was on the road. But I'll tell you what, it's not road there no kill. more. <laughs> road kill. <laughs> 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 yeah, you shouldn't be eating that roadkill. That's the problem. I didn't know. I thought it was just a name, no roadkill possible. <laughs> so how is it possible that Patsy was spared? Did she not eat at the same restaurant we as you? We all did, but I'm the only one that got it. Lucky <laughs> me. I'm so lucky. I'm a lucky guy. Hey, you. You're the fifth one on the fourth row. You got it. Maybe, it's, <laughs> maybe it was gender specific. Maybe it had to be a male. That's you right. were the only male in your entourage. No, try again. Oh, really? You had another guy? Who was yeah. with you? Yeah. My entourage, we met We met someone. They were. Oh, okay. And that, that was a male. Oh, it was when you were actually at a destination. I'm hoping. I don't know. We came yeah, back. Yeah, hoping. The only thing, well, you know, come to think of it, the only thing I had. Oh, well, here it is. That Patsy did not have. This is what it is right here. Was a cup of orange juice at the, at the Welcome Center. Oh, oh my. I wonder if it was bad. Yeah. I think that it was. That is the only thing that I had mm-hmm. that she did not have because she didn't want any. Well, there you go. Wow. A cup of orange juice at the Welcome Center. Oh, wow. That must have been bad Damn then. It. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Those darn Welcome Centers orange anyway. Juice. I know. It could have been something in the cup. But Ooh, yeah. Been, yeah. Anything. Yeah. Wow. But I was lucky I got it. They could have had some bad meat in there or something. Meat and oranges? You know, you know somebody goes, just stuck it in there. A like a rat, a rat. Like if a mouse climbed into Ew. the orange juice. And you know, they stirred it around. <laughs> Yuck. Yum. <laughs> no thanks. All right. Are we, okay. All right. It's making uh, me sick again. I'm so leaving. today I, I, I will read to you the unique thing about a state. You tell me the state. That's I'm all there is leaving. to it. You're making me sick. <laughs> You're making me sick. <laughs> You're making me sick. <laughs> I don't talk about no rat. You talk about a rat. I hope Patsy drives home. Because you're in no shape to drive. Okay. No, I when I said rat, I meant like you're right here, right now. Oh, right on, <laughs> right on, right on. All right, we will. Uh, <laughs> oh, he's dancing out there. Who's there? Dancing? He goes, yeah. the fella in oh, the red cap. Oh, there he is. <laughs> hey, he's, he's kissing. Yeah, him. he's rocking. There he's you rocking. go. There you Good go. job. All right, Dan, it's if you wouldn't mind, there you go. Okay, we will take a little break, <laughs> and uh, I'll play some commercials. And while these commercials are playing, we need somebody to bet on Joe. Who's very sick right now? Thank mm. you. Well, moderately sick. Moderate. And yes. somebody bet on Robin, and uh, the winner will get <laughs> <laughs> ten dollars worth of mini donuts it's and not. a car trunk organizer. That's the, the best organizer. part. That's what the, do- we have. the donuts is the best part. <laughs> yeah, from Doughboy. All right, we'll Come take on. a little break and uh, take your calls right now. Six two two nine six two two. If you'd like to play, we won't hold it against you. This is don't don't use the thirty day rule on these ones. No, no, these, we if, won't. If you win today, don't well, worry. You no can win. Thirty day rule. <laughs> yeah, because That's tomorrow right. could be a car. <laughs> See, this, this is the what I don't like. C A R D. But today, you know, you win today. You say, "Oh, come on! I don't want to win this." <laughs> exactly. I, the, the donuts are good. 
That's donuts right. Trust me, the donuts are good. They're good. Look at those cool sunglasses. I like those. I know. Well, you just like her green dress, and, and the legs are really good, too. Uh, yeah, maybe it's the whole With package. The pump oh, we got a kid. Yeah. <laughs> You've got a garden, and we've got a show for you. Garden with your host, Master Gardener Carol Ann Baldwin. Carol Ann answers your questions about your flowers, your veggies, your grass, your trees, even questions about your bugs. And she's only on WOCA, so don't miss Carol Ann Baldwin and You've Got a Garden each Tuesday from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. right here on WOCA The Source. Beautiful Moments Party Rentals presents Showcase Under the Stars, a bridal affair to remember. This event has it all. Caterers, photographers, florists, DJs, venues, and more. All gathered in one place and all there to help you plan your special day. Brides, bring your bridesmaids and friends alike. This is the event you don't want to miss. There will be food, fun, trivia games, and prizes with different wedding-themed areas to explore. Tickets are only $10 and Beautiful Moments Party Rentals is donating 100% to the United Way of Marion County. Advanced tickets can be purchased at Beautiful Moments Party Rentals, 3400 Southwest 60th Avenue in Ocala. Showcase Under the Stars takes place on March 13th from 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. So make plans to be there. Again, that's March 13th at Beautiful Moments Party Rentals from 5 to 9 p.m. If you have any questions, just give them a call. 307-8180. That's 307-8180. And make your plans to attend the Showcase Under the Stars. Showcase Under the Stars. There you go. Eight minutes before. Before, before 12 o'clock. That's I'll, tell you, I'll tell you what. Hmm. We have a lot coming up in March and April. I'll tell you what. Yeah. Who, th- yeah. who would have thunk it, right? Well, we got a uh, showcase under the stars. Right. Mm-hmm. We've got Ocala's Got Talent. Right. We've got Jazz on the Green coming up. Mm-hmm. So, right. I mean, that's a, that's, a, that's a lot of stuff. Is that what you called it when you got sick? Jazz on the green coming up. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to be thinking Jazz about on the green next coming up. it happens. <laughs> You're bringing back memories I don't want to remember. <laughs> it was like an old song. You know, I, I want to point out that that commercial that Kelly just read or did, whatever, yes, yes. is the textbook perfect commercial. does the three things. You're supposed to advertise a special. Yes. You know, you're supposed to advertise frequently, yes. and you're supposed to advertise early. Yeah, that's right. All three things she's that's got. That's called in. marketing. Very good. Larry. Uh, well, she's obviously good at what she does. That's right. Either that or she had help from you and Dan. Someone or. wrote it. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, she had help. <laughs> all right, all right. Are you ready? I'm going to read you the unique things. Grady is betting on you, Joe. Yes. And uh, Philip is betting on you, Robin. Yep. Boston, Mass. <laughs> <laughs> now all you need is the name of a state. Oh. Name the only state. Yeah. To host three modern Olympic games. Georgia. No. Uh, Florida? No. It's a modern state. <laughs> no, no, it was oh, modern, modern Olympic games. Modern Olympic games. In other words, not games. the ancient Olympic games. Oh, New York. No. See, I was going to say New York, so then I'll go with uh, Washington? No. Come on, do you know? California. California is right. That would have been my job. next one coming up. And who's the point for? Coming up. <laughs> Joe is so pitiful. Have to give him the point today. Thank you. Joe gets a pity point. Joe and Greedy on the board. Pity point for Joe. All right. Name the only state in the country to have a county where a plurality of citizens report their primary and their primary (laughs) ancestry as Polish. Wisconsin. Uh, No. No, that's a good guess though. Because no, Nebraska. There's a lot. No. Mm. Illinois. No. Oh, Michigan. No. You can, I want to say Connecticut. No. Morality. There's only one left. Oh. New York. <laughs> Come on, do you know? No, not New York. No one knows. Do you know? Yes, yes. Go ahead. I'm going to go with Joe's guess. Massachusetts. No, not Massachusetts. No. He no, didn't that, want to say hi. It's Pennsylvania. No. No, it's not. It's Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania have a one lot of- fourth of Luzerne County in the state's northeast region identifies as Polish American. Really? Really? Yeah. I wonder how many people work for the telephone company. Uh, oh, I should have known that <laughs> one. <laughs> I wonder how many. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, telephone there you go. poles there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh okay. I thought it was funny. All right. that's, yeah. that's my sick Robin got joke. it. I didn't get it right away. That's my sick joke. All right, name the only oh. state to have a unicameral legislature. Okay, what does that mean? I don't know. You <laughs> uh, Virginia. No. West Virginia. <laughs> no. Good morning, do you know? Nebraska. Nebraska is right. Oh, good. What's unicameral? Yes, what does that mean? <laughs> 
It means there's only one house. In other words, they don't have a house in the Senate. They just have one body that votes. Oh, ah, now okay. we know. Now we know. Yeah, Thanks. thank you. So who's the point for? Mr. Joe, please. Yay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. See, I can tell all sick jokes today. Pity points. <laughs> So all the sick jokes because right. I'm sick. What's the only state in the country with different designs on either side of its state flag? Connecticut. Well, New Mexico. No. 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 Not New Mexico. Utah. No. <laughs> different designs on both sides are of we, the Different we, designs on well, either we'll side of Well, we'll go with the crazy flag. California. No. No, Maine. No. Not New Mexico. Are we close? Those Maine? Uh, geographically, very far away. Oh. As far away as you can be, I okay. think. Okay, Oregon. Oregon is right. Woo! Philip, we were lucky. We got eight points. Oregon's oh, you're on lucky. the board. Oregon's flag has the state seal on its front. I beg your pardon. <laughs> and a beaver on its back. I doubly beg your pardon. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well. It's rough when you have a beaver on your back. <laughs> I bet it is. Tell you what. Yeah. Especially when you turn around. <laughs> my, <laughs> my, <laughs> you might get a job with Barnum and Bailey. Yeah. <laughs> what? I got a say. beaver on my back. Yeah. Come yeah. hey, here, fellas. <laughs> She's not a monkey. Step right in. Well, yeah. Ten cents. You get in to see. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm all turning around. What are we doing here? Somebody <laughs> behind us? <laughs> Larry's having fun with us. There's no one behind us, is there? <laughs> All right. No. Larry, name the only. <laughs> I turned around. Name, it hurts. <laughs> name the only state uh, in the United States whose yeah. legal right to statehood was brought before the Supreme Court. Legal right to statehood. Yeah. Mm. Texas. No. Louisiana. No. Are we in the vicinity? Mm, Robin's closer geographically. Oh, Louisiana, uh, you said? Yes. Mississippi? Is it Tennessee? Go, you're Kentucky? Closer. You're getting closer. West Virginia. West Virginia is right. Okay. I, I said that earlier. West Virginia versus... Oh, you said that earlier. I know. Oh, okay. And this not with this question. No, I didn't say it with that question. Oh, though. Virginia okay. versus West Virginia oh, was oh, the uh, oh, the legal thing. Uh, oh, okay. Virginia strove to regain counties that had seceded during the Civil War. Uh huh. Mm. Was decided in favor of the defendant. Succeeded. Mm. Yeah. Removed and separate. Yeah. What's the only state in the United States to have two Federal Reserve banks? Kentucky. No. Oh, Illinois. No. Oh. Mm. We both said... Uh, Indiana. <laughs> Starts with an M, if that helps. M- Mississippi. No, no. <laughs> Montana? No. Missouri. Missouri is right. Oh, good Missouri job. is right. The federal bank in Kansas City covers the Great Plains region, mm-hmm. while the bank in St. Louis covers part of central U.S. Part oh. of it, but not part all of it, just part of it. By the way, this is WOCA Ocala. The source. Close enough, right? We missed that. No, we didn't. We got it on time. Oh, you mean the other two no, days? Yeah. yeah when you Dan, get say I had the source later. Name the only state <laughs> in the United States uh-huh. named after a German-born monarch. Uh, oh, gee. Uh, <laughs> um, uh, I don't know. Oh, uh, 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 m- uh, m- m- the only state in the United States named after a German-born uh, mo- monarch. Uh, Michigan. No. Good morning. Do you know? I think it might be Georgia. It is Georgia. Yes. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Russia has a Georgia in it. That's right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Who's the point for it, Pete? <laughs> <laughs> well, Germany is <laughs> Georgia and Russia. There is. I don't you know, know what it has to do with Russia. <laughs> Georgia. <laughs> Georgia was named Easter after Britain's too. King George II. <laughs> oh. Who was born in Hanover, Germany. <laughs> oh, I thought it was Russia. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's okay. You get the point. Four for greedy. Two for Philip. Oh yeah, yeah. What? <laughs> I say something wrong. Uh, name the only state no, in the United that. States whose official name is more than four words long. Connecticut. <laughs> no, not syllables. Oh, <laughs> words. Four words. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Montana. I know. It's, I never. This is unusual. Is it Montana. No. no. Show me state is four words though, so it's more than four words. Twenty. Do you know? Florida. Rhode Island. Rhode Island is right. Rhode Island? Yes. How? What is that? Be- is Pete, do you know? The official name is Rhode Island and Providence Plantation. Wow, very wow. good. Wow. Oh, okay. my goodness. The smallest state has the biggest name. <laughs> That's right, Larry. <laughs> Joe, please. Okay. Joe gets the point. Thank you, Pete. Appreciate smallest that. smallest state has a big... Wow. So hmm. they... It's like when people... 
came here from other other parts of the world they changed their name to make it shorter <laughs> so i yes. wonder why that that initiated here why didn't it make it shorter rhode island rhode island and provincial Pro- plantations yeah providence plantations i don't know what happened providence why did they take that away i wonder no they didn't it's still there well, yeah but why does everybody just call it rhode island it's easier okay it's not even an island <laughs> i know i know <laughs> Okay. All right. Next I'm one. I'm a master of my domain. Next one. <laughs> well, I'm happy to hear that. Thank you. <laughs> Was that a Seinfeld reference? Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. And we should have that same competition here. Uh, there what? you go. That's a good idea. What are you talking about? Yeah, no, I have talking no about. idea. All right, here we go. Here's the next one. Yes. Uh, name the only state with a statewide ban oh. on the carrying of concealed firearms. Oh, New York. No. Nevada. New Jersey. No. Then really? let's go crazy with, say, uh, um, Arizona. No. Montana. Are we anywhere near it? <laughs> uh, <laughs> no. Uh, Colorado. <laughs> right, oh, just, Utah. I'll just tell you. It's Illinois. Really? Oh. You can't have guns in Illinois? The, the only state with a statewide ban on the carrying of concealed firearms is Illinois. Oh, concealed. That is the nope. thing. Yeah. They have it on their hip. You can see it. It's okay. Yeah, there you go. The That's only right. other holdout, Wisconsin, lifted its ban in 2011. Well, good. There you go. Good for them. Hmm. So uh, they, they were they were otherwise known as American Band Stan. <laughs> All right. Name the only state... Where less than 26% of its citizens identify themselves as white. Mm, uh, Georgia? No, no, we had that one. South uh, Carolina, then? No. Um, Louisiana. <laughs> Mississippi? <laughs> I'm just laughing. Wow. It's hard to, hard to play this game because you just keep naming states. You can't, well, it's easy for you. <laughs> Alabama, there you go. Good morning, do you know? <laughs> he said no. Hawaii? Hawaii is right. Yes. How's he oh, doing this? Oh, there you go. Good How job. How's he doing this? Unbelievable. <laughs> hey, he's amazing. <laughs> What's the point for? Send out a big aloha to Joe, please. Oh, aloha to aloha. Joe. Aloha. Aloha. Okay. Aloha. 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 Name the only. Tell me. Name the only state whose current state capitol building predates the revolution. Revolution. Mm. Yeah, the house for the the, the uh, building was built in 1772. Pencil- Connecticut, Pennsylvania. No. Hmm. West Virginia. <laughs> you said no, West we Virginia. had that one. Already. So go with That's Virginia right. then. Okay, no. Pens- oh, we did Pennsylvania. But you're in the vicinity, geographically speaking. Uh, oh, sure, Vermont. <laughs> oh, you're way far away. Oh, oh well, cool. I screwed that one. Go up. back where you were. Go back where I was. Oh, back to that general area. Hmm. What New Jersey? It? No, go south, young lady. South. Georgia. <laughs> no, not that far south. Oh, they're painting up. All right, mm. one more and I'll tell you what it is. Tennessee. No, it's Maryland. Oh, forgot about Maryland. The Maryland State House was built in 1772. It has a unique wooden dome which was constructed without nails. Wow. Pretty good. Oh, we got to see that one. Oh, what I want to say and I can't. Go ahead. <laughs> Name the only state without a McDonald's within the borders of its state capital. <laughs> oh. Oh, gee, Utah. No. Get out of here. No. <laughs> <laughs> Maine. No, you're close. Oh. Maine is close. Maine. Massachusetts? No, yeah. Um, Rob was closer. Oh, Maine. Vermont. Then. Vermont is right. There you go. Good job. Right. Vermont. Right. Mont- dang time. Montpelier yeah. is also the smallest state capital, less than 8,000 people. Oh, 8, okay. 8,000 people in the capital. Uh, name the only state uh-huh. whose official state seal is not circular. Oh, Alaska. No. Not circular. Mm. That means it could be a rectangle, a star. Right. Yeah. Right. Texas. No. Oh. <laughs> no. Oh, well, I don't know. This is probably a star in it. But is it California? No. Uh, Minnesota. It starts with a C, if that helps. A Colorado. C. No. Uh. Not Col- what other state starts with a C? <laughs> Colorado. Connecticut. Connecticut. Right? Connecticut, right? Don't say right. Connecticut. <laughs> Is that the answer? <laughs> I got your fallback. <laughs> <laughs> I got your fallback. <laughs> Connecticut seal 
is three grapevines and a state motto in oval shape. Oh, okay. <laughs> Larry, who won? <laughs> Are we there yet? Oh, yeah, I see. Yes, oh, yeah. Who won? Oh, Grady wins. Come pick up the oh, prize. Oh, I won. Grady ah, has ah, seven. Ah, Grady and Joe. Yay, Thanks Philip has three. Come pick up this your prize, works. Grady. Let's do this tomorrow with a better help. <gasps> with a better help? Well, you, yeah, had, me. you had pretty good help today. I had great help. I'm talking about me. I was beyond help. Today. I hope you're feeling better. I'm glad you're feeling better. I hope you're feeling better than yeah. better tomorrow. Yes. All right, hang in there. Here comes, what's his name? Glenn Beck. Glenn Beck. <laughs> <laughs> what you're about to hear is the fusion of entertainment and enlightenment. This is the Glenn Beck Program. <laughs> 